just do his part. Quick throw to Mumfield, and he tries to make a man miss. Play clock at three. Slovis able to get it off. Pressure set. As far as the run and the pass, you're going to see Bartlett, who's really known for his speed and his ability to rush with finesse. Ball at the four. Slovis snap high. Plenty of time over the middle and the first completion for Keaton Slovis. As a run, so Slovis, that his first completion. First and ten, ball at the 24. Slovis again, plenty of time, sets his feet, goes to the sideline, and that's Mumpfield. Then early on in the second series, he runs the football, runs the football, shows big personnel. West Virginia's thinking, hey, they're going to get another run action type of play. He pulls it and throws. And then on that last play, back in the I formation, another play fake for Slovis, forced out of the pocket. You know, Slovis a little high step, but Lee Koba missed the tackle in the first down point. Well, they told me, do not sleep on Keaton Slovis's athleticism. And if you're going to give him the edge, just right there like Linnell Cart Comes in with 26 career starts, has experience at USC. Again over the middle, and it's Bob Means. He averaged over 19 yards per reception last year at La Tech. You know he can make big plays. Again, this drive started at Pittsburgh's three. Slovis momentum has to climb the pocket, and he's brought down by Mallinger. By Davis Mallinger. You're going to see him come on the rush on the outside against Abanacanda, and then he realizes, look, I'm too deep in the pocket. The ball to 29, Slovis in the shotgun. Again, has to use his feet because of the pressure. Ball completed. Run, run, run. Play action pass. Hit him over the top. Here comes the play action now. Slovis to the sidelines. Picked off. They're going to say Wesley yeah, McCormick was out of bounds. Play clock to five. Slovis, plenty of time back there. And he's going to pull it down and try to get it himself. Example of the improved athleticism on the West Virginia in the West Virginia secondary being able to match up down the field one-on-one -on -one. Slovis has nowhere to go with the football decides to pull it down and try and run for it and You see the left foot go out of bounds before he tries to die for the first down marker, but again That's a nice job by West Virginia Now an empty backfield for Slovis First and 15 after the penalty pressure Slovis gets it away and what a move by Bob Means, ball on the turf. West Virginia says they have it, and they do. To force the turnover. Going on the field, the completed catch, right here. a fumble, yeah, recovered by the defense. Coming First the down, end. West Virginia. Puts a big hit. The old turnover dunk. Play fake. Time. Slovis to the sideline. Second and goal, Slovis the fake to the end zone, misses his receiver, overthrows Mumfield. Beautiful whip route came in, came back out. You're going to see it right there. So just shy of the 25-yard line of Batacanda, going to start the half. Play fake, Slovis going to take a shot, has Mumfield. I mean, we've seen all of these guys flying around to the football and making big plays for this defense. So an early third down for Slovis. Has to escape the pressure, and he can't. Providing problems. Well, Jared Bartlett is the guy who really can rush with speed. And you see him come around the edge and then work back up in the pocket. So second and eight. The fake to a can. The pressure coming. Slovis sets his feet. Takes a shot. Has a man dropped. It's their DNA. You see Bub Means. He has Wesley McCormick beat. Miss right there for Pittsburgh. Bub had the fumble in the first half. A drop there. Slovis over the middle. That's caught. First down. Jaden Bradley. Those high-low crossers really trying to take advantage of those underneath defenders. Running a receiver in front of the under. We'll see if he can break one, but give credit to West Virginia's defense. Another play fake from Slovis, another opportunity, takes a shot downfield, two pit receivers in the area. Third and nine for Pitt, Slovis again over the middle and a big hit on Mumfield. Whoa, he has done it. 
West Virginia showing pressure, and again the handoff, oh, fake the handoff over the middle to Jared Wayne. Wayne makes a man miss. Jared Wayne off to the races, inside the 20, 10, 5 to the 3. We've been saying it all game long, that off of the play action pass, the second level defenders have been one day to realize Koba was going to be the guy that was going to be the quarterback of this defense. Here comes the pressure. Slogus out of the backfield. Finds Hammond all by himself. Across the 50. Hammond gets a block. One man to beat. Hammond. It's Virginia showing pressure on Slovis. Play fake pulls it. Quick throw to the sidelines. And he overthrows Jared Wayne. On offense with their downfield passing attack. Slovis pressured. Being chased. Has to throw it away, and West Virginia, a great job. Open it up a little bit. They do that on first down. Slovis time. Shot downfield. Get him the football. So another pass for Slovis out of the shotgun. Forced out of the pocket. He's going to go down. Quarterback's got to know when the play's Yeah, gone. he's just got to get rid of it. But Dante Stills, watch him adjust his, his, his attack angle. For defense, all the credit. Now wait. Can play two. Second and 24. Slovis. And that's incomplete. He's got to settle himself down and answer. They're at him again. Around. He's not really keeping his eyes down the field. You see here, but even if you could just take a take a play, get the ball out of your hands, and even if you don't pick up the first down. Hammond two yards on first down. Slovis empty backfield out of the shotgun. Quick throw, caught. You're trying to see if you can run some kind of double move on him. You see the safety playing real short. Maybe they try and give him help. That's who I would get after. Ball at the 32. Pressure again on Slovis, able to get the ball off. They don't allow a big play out of here. Are they going to go single high and leave somebody one-on-one? -on -one? Slovis has time, takes a shot. That's Mumpfield downfield, and Mumpfield's going to move the chains inside the 30. He's going to have a fantastic year. He's got everything at his ar in his arsenal. Does it again. Pressure comes. Slovis forced out of the pocket. Has a man open downfield, and it's Mumpfield again. He cuts down. He's picking up right where he left off. Across the middle is Slovis. That's a bad at Kanda. Makes a man miss. There goes Izzy. Izzy! Over a decade. Run after, run after the catch is key, right? You see a Banacanda just run the halfback 